I have no manhood. Well, um, more MOP stuff. Got some days coming soon. Coming soon, but I wanted to do this review first, you know. So, yeah. Daring done. Morning, Pinkie Pie. This episode Get starts off with Pinkie Pie right getting here. a newsletter. What is the currency in Equestria? And it's always good to be a pony in the know, you know? And there's so much to know! Uh, seems like a bunch of boring hooey to me. It's going to be a great wall. Really big, really tall. Just an amazing wall. What about Paris Bright Infant Station in Philadelphia eradicated? Wait, Paris Bright Infant Station? Never heard from those fuckers since freaking season one. I want to see that. Oh, that's great news! Eh, another day, another Paris Bright hype story. Wait, so wait, Paris Bright or not Paris Bright? But I meant hype, hype stories and like fake, like over dramatized the news to get higher ratings is actually canon in Equestria. That's actually really nice. Wait, no, it's not. Official food of Winneapolis. Author A.K. Yearling announces retirement. Wait, 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 no, 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 go, 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 go back. Twelve-scale election heating up for candidate in favor of Kalina Dam. What? Oh, let me see that. I never knew you were so into politics, Rainbow. I mean, China is a great country. Just, just a great country. By the way, all those things those news sources said about me. Fake news. Well, she either A, there's not much left to do anymore, I mean, seriously, how many relics and sh fucking temples and shit are in the world of Equestria? B, she could just be getting old and the person, at some point she gotta retire. Or C, she found out about the journal being published and she realized her secret identity is out there for all to see and now she fucking probably hates every single one of you and now she's retiring because everybody knows she's near and do so she's like, well fuck this, I'm not gonna be in there and do no more. I never would have taken Pinky to be the in charge type. <laughs> AK, it's us! Rainbow Dead and Pinkie Pie! You're friends! I don't have any friends! It just says you're giving up writing stories! But most ponies don't know that you actually are daring to, and that the stories are real! I wouldn't bet on that. AK, as your friends, we completely understand. Right, Rainbow Dash? Can you see more of this? It's like it's like Pinky's maturing. It's actually some good character development. That's not true. They're not mad at AK Yearling. They're mad at Daring Do. I take back what I said. It is true. What? I guess I've always been so focused on saving priceless relics and stopping the bad guys that I never really thought about the mess I leave behind. How could Rainbow Dash and Pinky not know this? I mean, you don't have to actually know it or realize that there are going to be casualties. I mean, if you want to see the worst case of casualties from superheroes and stuff trying to save the world, just look at the Avengers and all their casualties.
Zip, 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 zip. This is so cool. It looks just like that village in your last book where Daring Doom recovers the Doom Diadem from the Wild Bunch gang who chase after her through the desert. Wait a minute. Okay, okay, okay. She saw it in the book? I thought, okay, I thought these books were like regular reading books. <laughs> I, I bet. I bet Daring do, or AK or Ling, or this double identity, cri identity crisis she's constantly going through, whatever you want to call her. She, like, I bet she, like, makes a picture, a, like, lots of picture version, like, not very big words version of, like, more like a lower grade reading level version of her books meant exclusively for Rainbow Dash. So Rainbow Dash can enjoy the books without having to learn so many of the big words that she probably already includes in her regular books. <laughs> Just Rainbow Dash. <laughs> so here you got Rainbow Dash, you low level reader. <laughs> evil plot to separate the sister crown relics and if it wasn't for her the region would be cursed with eternal light and the entire town of somnambula would have sunk into the ground are we sure she wasn't trying to thwart nightmare moon hiya there mister hiya there grandpa recolor indeed Daddy do is a menace hi cavaleron One angry pony and Cavaleron. Okay, seriously, none of you realize that was Cavaleron? That was obviously him. Look, Pinky, it's the Get On In! Daring do stays here all the time in her adventure! Why does this remind me of uh, one of the inns I found in Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild? <laughs> Probably because I rode my horse over that inn when I found it. Mm. What the heck? <laughs> my nose is telling me to help myself to muffins. That's Derpy's line. I got this. A good evening to you, madame. We are but weary travelers who humbly wish to inquire on the status of a certain mayor of intrigue taking residence here. If there's anything I learned from any foreign language class ever, it's never do that. What in Southern Equestria are you on about? <laughs> in hopes for a good future. Why, that poor fella had his Clopaz necklace stolen by Daring Do just yesterday. That's Cavaleron. It stole our precious Clopaz. We need to make sure that if she turns up again, there will be consequences. Every pony who's with me, meet at the statue tomorrow. A.K. How do you not even notice that's Cavaleron? We're still staying the night, right? Okay. Hey guys, I already ate all the free mini muffins. <laughs> that's adorable. Exactly! Here it is! The remains of your, I mean, our somnambula statue! That's Cavaleron! I was Odo, he's about gay big, long neck, itty bitty face, weird cloth thingy on his tail. Accurate description. Russ, if that was Zodal, it got. She is making direct eye contact with him. And she still can't tell. When the story gets so real that like you just start imagining it in actual like, real life. The Sphinx gave her the riddle. I shine brightest in the dark. I am there but cannot be seen. 
to have me costs you nothing. To be without me costs you everything. Air. She instantly knew the answer. Oh! Dang it, I'm never good at riddles. She shouted. The Sphinx was so enraged. So the Sphinx? You should have just done what the Bow um, Bowser did when he was a Sphinx. Sonambula prevailed, and she explained that she had always hoped she could make things better for her people. That's not an explanation of how she beat the Sphinx. Here's a true explanation. Well, here's how it went. He gave me a riddle, I solved the fucking riddle. Then he was like, bitch, please, you know what, fuck this, I'm a reason prince. And then I was like, okay, you know what, why don't you give me more of a final challenge, anything. If I beat it, though, you're gonna have to fucking leave. Okay, got it, and he's like, ooh, okay. How about you walk to the prince while blindfolded and can't fly? It's like, bitch, please, I do this in my sleep. And I accomplished it, freed the prince, he left. Bitch, the kingdom is free. Who fought to protect this town? <laughs> if Sanambula were here today... Bitch, shut up. Hey, buddy! What did Jaren do ever do to you to deserve all this? Honey, everything! I swear, she's surprised that it's him. I'm going... spirit by destroying her reputation but i can't have you running off and telling her my plan hey bitch here's a good idea don't reveal the set plan Help! holy shit you two must have been walking really slow I've seen you chase Rainbow Dash for miles upon miles upon miles. What the fuck happened to that energy? Where's the Pinkie Pie I know? Cause more trouble. You won't. How do you know? I just do. <laughs> I just know, bitch. Because I know everything. I can break the fucking fourth wall. I'm like a fucking god. What the fuck are you, bitch? Tied up all the way over there when there's no bridge. And the same of losing your dear friend, Rainbow Dash, to this slime will. Oh, and that ancient magic from the legend is free. There'll be no flying in the pyramid. Good luck, Derry Do. You don't wish your enemies luck. Literally, that's just saying, I'm gonna lose. Also, I thought that magic only affected Somnambula when the Sphinx casted it. Does, did it affect the whole pyramid? I don't know. Rainbow Dash is our friend. Just like Somnambula. We need to make a leap of faith and hope that we can save her. Death. Hey, well, don't die with her. Where in the mother of fuck did those come from? Reminding you to never give up hope, Pinky. And I'm kinda hoping you ponies will untie me before we all take a bath in bubbly green slime! 
I, I mean, yeah, you could ruin the touchy moment and thankfulness and everything. I mean, I mean yeah, we are drinking green slime, but really, Rainbow Dash, you have to be so greedy. Why did they drop the bag? From miscreants like you. Where did the inn lady come from? The inn's like far out there. <laughs> Me too. But I'm glad I realized that even if you're fighting for something good, you're still responsible for your actions. This is actually a good message to give. A nice moral to the story. Yo, good job, Hasbro, and DHX, and all you at the studio. And so, Daring Do gets some of the stuff in the place replaced. Oh, no. Somnambula replaced. Pays the hotel fee. Everybody starts appreciating her and bans Kevin And they even managed to get a new Somnambula statue. How did she get the statue replaced? And that was Daring Done. A decent episode, and kind of odd to get another Daring Do episode, but um, in this season, since we had one back in season 6, and it's been mainly just every two seasons we got in a Daring Do episode. Um, it's also kind of strange how nowhere near the season we didn't get a Flame and Flam episode, since then we got another Daring Do episode already. It was, it's kind of weird, in my opinion, because, um, we've had... We've had like some characters will appear like every like two seasons in in like a certain order. Um, both Daring Do and um Daring Do and the Flintstone Brothers made their appearance in season two. Well, Daring Do was in the character was introduced technically as like a book for Rainbow Dash to read in season two. Actually, being in the show was in season four. But that was also the return of Flim Flam, and then season six we got another Darren Do episode and another episode of Flim Flam. Surprising one at least, at the very least. Um, and then, but this season we didn't get a Flim Flam episode, but we got already another Darren Do episode, and that's that's actually pretty nice. Yeah. Hmm. This is Nintendroni, the Unicorn Nintendo. Oh. This is Jewelry Alice and the Read the channel name. Nintendroni, the Unicorn Nintendo uh -oh, Nintendo player. Signing Wait, 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 wait. Bitches, please stay. Stay, stay. Don't forget to check out the Patreon, the Google Plus, and I'm planning on making a Twitter. Also, maybe a Tumblr oh, the um I believe it was Tumblr. It is also coming too. So, or yeah, just, uh, just in there. or not Tumblr. It was Instagram. Something. More social media sites will be coming. Thank you all for watching. And let's go back to the stream room. Oof. Until next time. Take care, everyone.